Our next guest is Dr. Chai K. Kang from Rabo Research Food and Agribusiness. Her work as a farm inputs analysis indicates the needed changes within the supplier channel. Please help me welcome Dr. Chai K. Kang. Hello everyone, my name is Jack Hai Kang. I'm an analyst in the research team of Rabobank. My role is to follow the latest technology development and translate that into business opportunities and also to quantify the impacts of these disruptions. And I'm going to tell a story about shifting from supplier to coach. This story is especially focused on the crop protection sectors. And I will uh, introduce this storyline by the three to one orders. Three means uh, three reasons why it is so important for the crop protection companies to uh, move forward uh, from supplier to, to coach. And these three reasons is in the following. One, the growth of uh, agrochemicals are face, facing great challenges due to resistance issue and also due to social pressure. Second, uh, this uh, price of uh, farm inputs, especially uh, crop protections, they are too expensive relatively to the value they create. So in one word, they are losing their uh, pricing power. And the third one is the public calls for sustainable changes and this uh, call for sustainable farming practice uh, stimulates policy changes. Uh, so that means for crop protection products, the new one, uh, they will face a strict um, registration process. And also for the old ones, uh, more of the old ones, they are in the risks of in entering the banning uh, list for various countries. And then uh, the next step, I will uh, talk about the two new drivers that stimulates uh, changes. They are agrotech and also biotech. Uh, agrotech, it opens the door for new um, for for precision farming and for e-commerce and then indoor farming. While biotech, it offers new tools, like new uh, alternative solutions, such as bio biologicals, and biocontrol, and also seed technologies. And then, f uh, in the end, I will focus on this uh, example of uh, new value creation. Uh, I call it coaching. By coaching, I mean uh, this is to offer the farmers with the decision that is made uh, based on the data. Uh, so for this, uh, the data needs to be collected and then processed and then analyzed. So in the end, lead to a, a decision that is the best for the uh, farmer to maximize their, their performance. So in such a way, the new uh, value will be created uh, by this uh, coaching service. And next, I will also show the quantitative result, how much value can be created by this coaching. Uh, so it shows like it varies between 26% uh, to 72%, depends on which farming systems it is. And then in the end, I will show uh, the challenges and the new risks uh, that is identified by this new coaching uh, business model. Thank you. Bye-bye. <music>